Welcome back to Yakuza Infinite War. Of course we can. So Drive safely. We done the dungeon, we done the Doku Island finally. It's time to just continue with the story. Cause Sujimon's more of a thing I can do on my own time anyways. But I really want to continue with the story. I want it to pull me in. I need it to pull me in. But right now I am interested at multiple points in the story, but for me. I don't know, it just doesn't feel as good as, um... Ooh. It doesn't feel as good as, like, a dragon story for me at the moment. But I'm hoping it changes. Alright, also I'm gonna do this real quick. I take your money. Ready to Everyone's weapon... Oh, I forgot to change his weapon back. That's on me. Break yourself! Yep, time to continue with the story. I'm gonna be playing with these classes, of course. I gotta level them up somehow. Let's go, let's go. Together, right? I'm up! I'm just gonna. Yeah. Let's get it done! Well, aren't you I'm gonna finish him off. Go! <laughs> No more holding back. Oh. I can do this. Take your best shot. You're in it. Let's go. Ready's all ever be. There we are. Good. I want you. Oh, I already own you. Ah, oh, why not? I'll try. You're gonna finish me off. Hyper. No, we'll give you a super. There you go. Will this persuade you? Come on, man. What's this all about? Let's see. And match. Okay. I'm all yours. Excellent. Alright. I'm gonna change Dachi's weapon back. I, mean, I forgot. I, it's not on that one, because we got... Uh, I want to meet you. Yeah, lightning in him. Yeah, don't do that. But yeah, let's continue with the story. Let's hope Hello. this hits me real good. I need it to do something. Suspicious ships. Something that comes by regularly. Maybe loads up on supplies and essentials. You can't think of anything, Takata? I haven't seen you in how long, and now this? Are you some undercover cop, man? We don't have time to waste. Can you think of anything or not? Uh, there's one boat like that, maybe. Ducks about every two weeks. Showed up again this morning. Shit, for real? It's here? Now? Yeah. No one's there, though. Crew's out at the moment. Perfect timing, then. Can you show it to us? I guess so. Follow me. I gotta say, this was damn good thinking, Tomazawa. Hey, I've always said I got connections. I uh, might be too good to be true. So, uh, Tomi and you go back a while? Yeah, maybe. A couple of Japanese boys who can't shake each other. Oh, really? Well, same to you, asshole. <laughs> so, why has it been so long since you came around last? Kasuga's out here probably knows you better than me now. According to him, you two are good buddies. Hey, lay off. It all worked out, didn't it? Takata-san? Yeah. How did you know my name? Oh, uh, that's a really good question. Uh, you introduced yourself. No, I didn't. Hmm. Kata? What the hell is this? Heretics, may the flames purify you in death. Come on, you're all pulling Kana? Seriously? Madam Nele, bless us in this endeavor. Yeah, that doesn't shock me. Ready to rumble. Time to go all out. Now you're back. No, he's, uh, we'll do that. <laughs> Let's get it done! Um, anyone 
close. Oh, actually, yes. That worked. Ready, not left me. Take your best. Damn. Nope, he moved. Okay, well. Got you now, Let's go. Finish him. You're in it now. Alright, Takata's defending. In other words, do not. That's cute. You think you're safe. Yep, goodbye. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Now, Here I believe I magic still works. As much as I want to, he has. Mm. No, I'll just do that. Fancy a sit. Time to go all out. All right. Oh, you're weak to electricity. And let's get it done. Goodbye. Onto the next level. Look at me go. Hey, I'm even stronger. I'm getting better at this. Nakata, damn it! When did you join Polycarpus? When? From my very first breath, you faithless bastard. Polycarpus is everywhere. All of Hawaii is brimming with the devout. And those of us righteous enough to be named Haku are all around you. Seeds sown in the soil, waiting for the bloom that will cleanse this fetid land. You're a Haku? Haku are in the city. They're not just all holed up at Nelly Island. Remember what Dana said at the orphanage? That's Price's strategy. Deploy the Haku like sleeper agents throughout the state. So they could be anywhere at any time? This is bullshit! The Sage's will is inescapable. There will be no refuge for the damned. May it be. Madam Nele, embrace us all. They just commit suicide? What? Hey, hey, Takata! They cyanided themselves, I think. The hell? He just... <laughs> it must be some kind of poison capsule or something. Bryce! He's completely insane! He doesn't care who he sacrifices. Just to stay the man in charge! I'm not seeing any cargo ships, by the way. And I bet the cops are coming fast. We need to back off for now. <sighs> Fine. Uh-uh. Miss Madam Nele, or whoever's up there, don't be too hard on the guy. Now the problem is, our fingerprints are all over the bodies. I think it's time to get out of here. Back to Yamai's until things cool down a little. Guess so. Hmm? Hmm? Hey, uh, can I help you? Oh no, we got more huh? of them. What? 
Cleansing flames of Madame Nelly. Come on. Huh? More Bryce's goons. Yo. Tommy's hour. Heads up. Wow. You messed with me. The battle's on. That's kicking time. I hate to say it, guys. Oh, you are in a bad spot. Because Burning Arrow rules. Yeah. Such a good move. I need to put Time that in to everybody. Oh, I mean, you thought you could, but you can't. <laughs> Are they all taking cyanide pills, too? He's got. These guys. Are they same as Takata? We gotta keep moving for now. Oh, I don't no? think we're moving. Wait, with this many around, is it safe to go back to Akane san? Damn it. You're right. Maybe you can give him the slip if we run. Let's try. Alright. Nope. Nope, I have nothing to say to you. In fact, you're correct. We shouldn't fight. You're the man. Take a walk, asshole. I am taking a walk. A very, no, I'm not staring at anything. I'm, I'm not looking at you. Aloha. Hey, I'm just in here to. Oh wow! Oh jeez! Oh. Thank you for. I'm leaving this way. I'm not staring at anything. Get ready for this. You're going down. Damn it. I can do this. I got zealots on me. Well, nice knowing you. Beautiful. Let's get it done. Well, um break yourself. Except I <laughs> Good move. All right. Oh wait, can I use this? Yes. I don't use this enough because I keep trying to say hi to everybody. I'm not. Don't. I'm not looking at you. Leave me alone. Hey. <clears throat> hey, Ichiban. Do you see those guys? Hmm. We can't be sure who's the enemy right now. Let's steer clear. Oh, we're not running over the bridge. They're making me go this way. What are you staring at? Alright, guess we're doing a fight against my will. Yo, turn on music. More Palakana zealots. That's picking time. Open one. Except I can't. Man, yeah. Samurai is awesome. Yes, I'm a fast learner. All right, move. What are you staring? I'm not staring at anything. All right, now let's slowly veer left. And over this bridge we go. I am Nelly, will purify you. <laughs> Here they come. Don't make a fool of me. I'll back you. You have it, boy. Time to go all out. Not who I wanted to attack. I wanted to go for that guy. Not Washington. Alright. 
ready as I'll ever be. Let's go. Got you now. Movement range extended. Ugh. Yo. Come on, gotta get going. Hello. I've got a bad feeling about the main hey, road. Man. Well, we could cut through the front of Crystal Aloha. Get a little, go, get to a little Japan hey, from there. Most of these Palikana guys are local, so districts with more tourists should be Yo. safer, right? Good thing it's homie. Let's move. Hey, you! Oh no. Now nah, move. Hey, you! Hey, you! Hey, you! Get out of my car! Alright, let's go! Time to go all out! Here we go! Right off! Care to dance? Be honored! Let's get it done! Oh, come on! Break! Break yourself! Accept our enemy and peace! Ready when you are! Alright! Go, go, go! Let's go! You're in it now! <laughs> okay. I mean, I have no problem with you assessing the situation. I can do this. Really? You think you're safe? Ready as I left. Got you now. Get a load of this. Come on. Time to go all out. You are let's do this. There we go. Uh, uh, that is so good. Where am I going? Oh, north. Oh, once we go this way. I'm gonna need a charging station after. Oh, hold on. Give me all your cash. Let's okay, you can have my cash. Full power. Do I have any time? Oh, wait, do I have you? Yeah. Okay. Uh, no time. Leave you. Go that way, so we have to go. I'll take you down. Come on. Who dare ping me on the cord disc? Or... Oh, no one important. Okay. All right. Let's go. Oh. Holy cow! Let's get it done. Open one. How you doing? Oh, we got a lot of them. We can't not get by without fighting. I'll sue you. Ready to run. Oh, you're gonna sue me. I can do you. Okay. 
Magical song and get a lie. Prepare yourself. There, maybe. Everyone, sing along. Hey, All right, yes, we got three. Damn. That's picking time. Break yourself. Let's go. Oh, I can do this! Nope, 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 nope. You don't see me. Alright, keep going north. Sorry, can't wave. It's gonna be time. Yes. Okay. Huh? 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 All right. Now we're gonna go. Oh, I know which way we're going. No, actually. I have to take a look. New. Alright, and then I wanna. It looks like there's someone. They're gonna try and cut me off. Screw you! Damn it! Time to go all out! I was doing so good. Don't get caught! You know what? Yeah, grab a bike. I need to get her a better weapon. Goodbye. Get a load of that. You missed. Another one in the back. Oh wait. This is it. That came out well. I wonder if there's anything good in here. You just say. Hello. Um. 
Not gonna lie, you have a really good sword. I might be able to make something out of that. I'm not gonna equip it. And then you have these really nice daggers. Mm. I already got those. I will use those in crafting later. Right now, I have to get away from these guys. Pick up speed, pick up speed. I'm not looking at you. Okay. <sighs> They're like goddamn locusts. Hey. Hey, over there. What's up? More of them? No, look where we are. Hmm? A shrine. Maybe we can sneak in there. Let things die down a bit. Press pass inside. Temple? What the hell? We've already pissed off one god today. <laughs> Ex <laughs> Ex Ex to uh, X ten you X ten you X ten circumstances. The god be cool with it. Probably. Come on. Okay. We're in a pinch here, aren't we, guys? I can't believe Bryce is so many steps ahead of us. Yeah, but like, why now? Huh? If Lonnie's on Nale Island, it doesn't make sense to spread out like this. I mean, if I were Bryce, why move my best people to the mainland now? You should be playing defensively. Protecting what he already has. Might have a point there. Is it possible that Lonnie's still in Honolulu somehow? That makes sense. If they haven't moved her to the island yet, Palakana's still vulnerable. And since we're running around all over the place, they need guard dogs to hold us back. An astute observation. Impressive, oh. kasuga san Wait. Oh, Jungin Han, you finally joined. However, it might behoove you to lower your voice. Jungi, yes, hey, I missed you, man. Where did you fly in? Hello. <laughs> hmm. I confess, it's been too long since I've gotten so much sun. It's a pleasure to meet you both, Jungi Han. I'm the Komijul organization's right hand. Kasuga-san and I met there. So he's not an enemy? Um, guess not. Now then, shall we catch up? All right, so now we have Sonny every original. Sonny is always asking about your well-being. In spite of her demeanor, she's something of a busybody. Sonny, huh? She's still in Ijinsha with Kiryu-san and Namba now, right? Kind of. <laughs> Indeed. They're in touch with Zhao as well. That's why Sunny decided Hawaii would be a more useful place for me. I arrived two days ago. No kidding. Hm. Where you been for 48 hours? Carrying out my orders. Determining Nele Island's means of transportation. Hold on. You've been after their cargo ships too? Yes. If their shutters were to come down now, the game would be over. Therefore, Palikana's point of access must be found immediately. Such are Sunhee's instructions. Then we're on the same page. Well then, were you able to find their ships? Please, take a look at this. I retrieved this photo by hacking into a government satellite. I'll keep which nation a secret. This is Nelly Island, here. That's it? Nelly Island? Yesterday, this ship was photographed departing from the island's port. Advancing the time, we can follow its route across the sea. Until finally, it docks on our island here. Considering its size, it must be a cargo transport. Knowing what we know, I expect Lonnie will be aboard when it next embarks. Where's the ship now? Honolulu Bay, somewhere out of sight beneath the cliffs. Wherever it is they dock their ships, Palikana was smart to keep it obscured. As of now, the boat seems to still be safe in harbor, which means that Lonnie is as well. All right, let's get to that dock. When Lonnie shows up, we'll intercept them and get her back. Easy there, killer. I don't think it's gonna be that simple. That would be a fine plan, but the cliffs are 200 meters tall with almost a 90 degree ascent. Even for an expert climber, that would be a challenge. And what about Palakana? They must have a way to get cargo on board. I would presume there to be a concealed pathway to the harbor from land. 
Unfortunately, I'd been unable to find even a hint of such a thing in the photos. Were I to guess, could be located underground. Somewhere below street level. <gasps> what is it, Chichan? Remember back when I went to District 5 on my own? Yeah, that was just after you left me naked on the beach, right? I didn't ask you to remember that part. Anyway, we took the subterranean path to Dwight's hotel to get there. Along the way, I saw the route branch off in another direction. What's that way? I asked, and the Barracuda with me just said, Nothing. You didn't see that. Back then, I didn't want to think too much about it. That could be it! That could be exactly what we're looking for! Bryce owns the Barracudas, so it only makes sense they'd run that tunnel. I know you're all excited. But District 5 again? Every time we go there, I eat shit. If it's any consolation, we're gonna eat shit everywhere in town now. Ugh, the undercover cultists. God damn it. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Wouldn't you rather die trying? <sighs> Fine. What's one more ass kicking if it wins us the war? Attaboy. <laughs> I must say, Kasuga-san, you remain a curious fellow. Everywhere you go, you're able to attract the most dangerous foes and most reliable allies. I envy you. And to be honest, I could do without the foes. Anyway, man, Balikana really needs to get theirs. Are you flying back soon? Not at all. If you're willing to have me, I'd be glad to rejoin the party. Oh, hell yeah! I was hoping you'd say that! Juki and Hung is Excellent. Now, are your Hitman moves still the same? Because they're really good. Kasuga-san. Kasuga-san, if I may, we would be wise to restock our supplies before stepping into District 5, yes? For sure. By the way, um... Hmm? Sup? Aren't you hot in that thing? I suppose I spared no time to change. Jeez, man, I'm sweating just looking at you. And honestly, it's only getting to it. It's only going to attract unwanted attention as we go. Definitely. You stand there like a sore thumb wrapped in a garbage bag. Uh. I see. I wasn't aware my attire was so problematic. <laughs> hey, don't be embarrassed. We should resupply anyway. Like you said, we'll get you some new threads while we're at it. So, Anaconda then? Better get ready. Get ready to watch Understood. our backs. I shall follow your lead. When in Rome, as they say. Street's quiet. If we're going, now's the time. Okay. Alright, let's move. I'm interested in seeing what his attire is going to be. Oh, what's that giant mouse monster? It freaks me out. Oh, that's Kamalab. Kamrocho's mascot. Like back in Japan? Yeah, most districts have one. Kamalab promotes peace and safety. Peace and safety, huh? Yep. In Kamurocho? Uh, yeah. How's that working out for him? <laughs> Don't give up, Adachi son. Nah, Chitose's right. It is pretty dumb. Hey, come on. Anyone can start over from rock bottom. Kamrocho really might become a safe place someday. Think so? I mean, probably. Sheesh, if you don't even believe in Kamalap. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, I still need a few more. All right, let me see. Uh, gear, let's see what you got, Juging Hun. You got some, oh, you use the paws. Uh. <laughs> crimson hat, crimson jacket. He just came in with some good gear. Holy cow. Bullet of memory. And because you're the man, I am giving you a war god keystone. Um, thing is, is I'm gonna probably edit, remove you for her. But does that also mean that... No, okay, it didn't arrive yet. Also, I said I was gonna do a Dachi's thing, but not now because, yeah, a lot of things are happening, so I will do it later. 
Actually, yeah, I'm gonna go to the Sujima PC or something. Got 71,000. But yeah, I'm curious what his outfit's gonna be. Aloha! Nah. Thank good. you! I gotta do Sujimon stuff though, I know I do. Okay, got a new Sujimon. Awesome. Um, I don't need nature. We'll do basic. I could have did that, but that's a master ticket. Yeah, I should have. Here we go. Okay. Gains chaser. Thermworm, Jabber Jobber, Gang Punk, a Bummer Strummer, a Self Proclaimed Witch, another Brummer, a Committee Agent, Powered Tool. Let's get stronger together. All right, we got one new one. All right. All right, Jukin Hun, you're level 38, so you are behind us. I'm gonna check your stats out. So let's see, right here you are. Not what I meant. Not what I meant. Uh, job, thank you. All right, you're level 25. What skills do you have? Divine shot. Oh yeah. Essence of trick shot. Essence of mirror image. All right. And yeah, I'm gonna have to become your buddy. I know. We'll definitely do that on a different time. What is it? I could ruin you. But Got I'm it. not that mean. Yet. Alright, let's get Jugin on his Hawaiian attire. Hey. Remember, anyone here could be one of Bryce's people. And we shouldn't waste time. First stop, clothes for um, Mr. Han here. Alright. I'm not looking at you. I'm not even giving you a side eye. Everyone is so ready to punch somebody. All right, Jugin Hunt, let's see what you do. How about this place? Well, their stock does seem as though it would le lend itself to mobility. Okay, let's take a look. Hmm? How about this? Huh? Are you joking? That crap's like 10 years out of fashion. Now, nah, get our man something like no. this. You're crazy. That's probably the oldest thing in the whole mall. You wanna go? That's because it's timeless. What do you suggest? <laughs> <laughs> Thought you'd never ask. Get a load of this baby. Wow. Whoa. That is stylish. <sighs> That'll be outdated in two minutes after you ring Stop. it Stop! You idiots, we're trying to make him look less noticeable. Ah, right. Guess I kind of forgot that part. <sighs> oh, dear. So, you want something easy to move in and inconspicuous, right? You're yeah? right. Precisely. A fabric that breathes well, preferably. How about this? Price is pretty reasonable. Oh. Hey, not bad. Oh. Hmm. I've got no complaints. Zhung. Yes. Zhungi. It's immaculate. I'll take it at once. Apologies for making you wait. How do I look? <laughs> not bad. Figures Chi Chan uh, would make the best call. <laughs> Never should that uh, never should have been any doubt. Mm. Yeah, well, I still say he could have used a little more panache. The mitt is definitely a fashion. <laughs> mm hmm. What's funny? No. 
I just realized. I almost forgotten we're in a race against time. This it was quite enjoyable as distractions let's go. <laughs> well, let's come back again and shop more when the clock's not Naturally. ticking. Indeed. I look forward to Yo. that. All right, let's pick up whatever else we need then. I don't want to head, but I don't think we should head the Amaze just yet. How about one last stop to ever Okay. Mm. Yep, yep. Come on, bring it up. A little more. Let's keep going. Oh, I'll stop to eight. These shopping malls are so fun to walk around. Yeah, everyone's enjoying themselves, so you feel happy too. And way more styles than you can find in Japan. Chichan, what's that you're looking at? Oh, I can't help myself with little things like these. Look, it's a chicken in a bathtub. How cute is that? Um, sure, but what do you even use it for? Huh? Oh, I don't know. I think it's a lighter. Oh, that duck is hula dancing. Why do I get the feeling your room's filled with this stuff? All right. Plus, Jingging Hun, your suit's pretty all right. All right, let's see. Is there anything I can make? I don't have much, Please. but let's see. Welcome. Hello. Um, hello. Hello. Oh dear, we got one of those points where the game's like, we want to load, but we don't know how to do it. For some reason. Don't worry, any second now. There we go, I took a bit. Craft weapon. Let's check out Hitman. Ooh. Yeah, that's... Uh, if we had iron gloves, I could make you those. Ooh. Alright, let's see. Is there... Assassin? Alright, let's start. Oh, there it goes. Alright, no, no, no. No, no. Oh! Oh, these are maracas. But, nah, I'm gonna hold off for now. I can make a new breaker, anklet, but I don't need one. Samurai, no. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Shame. Thank you. All right. I have an idea. I want to do something. We're going to a Aloe Happy. Oh, I knew it. Juking Huns, things are all over. Ah, oh, dang habit. Oh, I definitely, definitely knew that was going to happen. I knew it was going to happen. Well, might as well start doing them. What I was going to do is change everyone's class to their original class, but... Well, we're doing this now. You got a Sujimon gacha ticket. This area is packed with luxury cars. Sure feels swanky, don't it? Also, check out that convertible. Oh, it must feel great to ride with the top down at the height of summer. You are naive, Kasuga-san. A convertible in the summer is nothing but a steel trap. All fun and games, till you hit a traffic jam or a stoplight, and suddenly, you're in hell. There's no buffer between you and the sun, so you get hit directly by all that heat. People with dark hair should be even more mindful. Dark hair attracts more solar energy. Holy cow. Man, when you put it that way, it sounds pretty awful. Oh, hey, so that's why your hair's that color then. <laughs> Do you really think this iconic look was all for the sake of some convertible? We really <laughs> opened up. <laughs> yeah, definitely, Judy. Definitely. Damn! I misplaced the list of souvenirs that Sony entrusted me with. A souvenir list? She actually gave you one of those? Yes. I remember most of it, so I'm rewriting what I can. But it seems the very last item is escaping me. 
Was it a dragon keychain or a wooden sword? Mm. Does Sonny think you're out here on a field trip or something? All right. <laughs> yep. Acquire souvenirs. That's the most important part. All right. Oh, wait. First, let's do the chicken. Hey, this is random, but do you think any of the shops around here sell chicken breast? I usually prep some after working out. How often does bodybuilding cross your mind anyway? Ah, scratch that. I bet seeing that chicken reminded you. Uh, I have no idea what you're talking about. We're really opening up. Dollars are tough, man. Shopping's hard. They suck at adding decimals. Really? I've never had any issues with it. Oh, uh, then can I toss an equation your way? Please. How about 1464 plus 4839 plus 8697? <laughs> Piece of cake. Exactly 150. Oh, impressive! Of course, I can't tell if you got a right or not. Ah, why do I even bother? All right. Yep, mental math. That's a skill. I don't really have that one. Yeah, that smells crazy good. It makes me kind of hungry. That place has some killer spicy soup. It makes you sweat like a pig, but so worth it. That sounds tempting, but I'll have to refrain. Huh? Can't handle spicy food? I can, but I have a cold sore. Not sure why I get them so often. Damn. How much we can do about that, then? Most of the shops around here go hard with the spices. Uh, you maybe want some rice porridge or something? I, um... Uh... Oh, it seems I've miraculously healed. Liar. We're really opening up! <laughs> yep, yeah, nope. That happened to me, too. Oh, okay, cool. I can play at the casino. Alright. Ooh, I have an eight here. Hey, Jukin Han, you know that cold sore you definitely don't have anymore? Yep. I'm apologizing now. Time to eat. These sesame balls are to die for. I could eat a whole boatload. Just be careful, because these tend to be quite hot. I know, I know. No, little kid. Uh, uh, ah, what the feeling? It burns. Hey, didn't a man just warn you? You don't have to rush right into. God, man, that's hot. Now look who's talking. Oh, let me get some of those. Ah! Oh, jeez, got me too. All right, I've had enough of your silly gags. Can't we just enjoy this in peace? Oh. Yeah. Oh. It's the hottest I've ever... How can something even be this hot? Oh. Talk about eating your words. <laughs> Ooh, willpower. That's good for spell casting. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. Use my plate. That's funny, though. That was funny. And we're slightly drunk. Which I'll walk off in. Hmm. Price on these macadamia nuts is the best I've seen so far. Are you a fan of them? They're all right. I plan to buy some as gifts for Komijo. Ah, oh, look at you being all thoughtful. Well, we are a vast organization. I'm just scouting out the best deal. But Komijo is quite strict about limiting its cash expenditures. So even macadamia nuts count as business expenses. All right. Hmm, okay. <laughs> Also, hi, lady. Organic, eh? Oh, there's a banana. Oh, thanks for the divine water. I can use that. All right. Off we go. Ah. Hmm? What's wrong? I'm afraid I made a horrendous oversight while leaving for Hawaii. Wait, what do you mean? Is one of our friends in danger? Before I left Japan, I may have neglected to return my rental DVDs. Uh, <clears throat> this is 
truly a disaster. At this rate, they're bound to charge me a late fee. <sighs> Get over it. <laughs> We're really opening up. <laughs> oh, late fees. Oh, I remember running things. Uh... <sighs> You good, Jungi? You look like you're sulking over something. Oh, it's nothing. Just ignore me. Come on, now I have to oh. know. The least I can do is listen. I have a pimple right on my face. Wait, what? Is that all? What do you mean, is that all? I'm stuck with a giant pus pod, damn it. From now on, I'm on a strict vitamins only diet. Your understanding is appreciated. Seems like this is a big deal for him. Hey, but you gotta eat an actual meal at some point. Aloha. All right. Huh. I mean, we all hate pimples, but I don't wreck that bad. It's like, ah, oh, I got a pimple. I'll go away. The ocean uh, always reminds me of that time I got stung by a jellyfish. I was scared of them for a long time after that. Are you okay with them now? Yeah. Thankfully, something helped me get over it. Something? Well, did a jellyfish save you from drowning? Nah. Ice cream. Huh? Found this place that served jellyfish ice cream, and I got hooked on the stuff. You know, figured shit. These little guys ain't so bad after all. <laughs> are you kidding me? Hey, next time adachi sans weak to something in a fight, we can what just have a meet it. <sighs> Swimming out here is a breeze. What a pleasure. It sure is refreshing, but when you say out here, do you tend to have a hard time swimming in the ocean? Well, actually, you know how my job often requires infiltration? Sneaking through jagged coastlines or swamps is no walk in the park. All right. In comparison, I bet you could swim the beaches of Hawaii hey, in your sleep. Asshole. Just recently, I even had to hey, swim an entire asshole. river upstream. Dude, are you even hey, human? We're really opening up. Okay. Feel like I've gotten to know them well. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there very slowly, June Dean, but we're getting there. Sure are a lot of kiddos out here. Should we make a huge sandcastle too? You sound like a kid yourself. Besides, I'm too skilled to compete against amateurs. What do you mean, skilled? They're just playing in the sand? <laughs> to me, it's a form of art. After I ascertain the correct sand to water ratio, I sculpt only with absolute precision. With these two hands, I can build literally anything. Where'd you master a random ass skill like that? That information, strictly confidential. Hmm. All right. He's good building things out We're so close now. Okay. All right, well, that's a weird skill indeed. I started cooking to improve my physique these days. I'm feeling even more toned. How, Jungi? I bet you're picky about your meals. Of course, but I'm also choosy with ingredients. Just the other day, I scaled a cliffside to harvest some pristine mushrooms. Safe to say that diet isn't the only reason you're so jacked lately. We're really opening up. Hmm, okay. There are a ton of dogs being walked in this area. They're adorable. I may not look like the type, but animals tend to really like me. I even attract birds. Just the other day, a parrot flew over and landed on me. A parrot? Yeah. Then afterwards, a strange man came over and asked me for money. Dude, doesn't it seem like that parrot was just part of a scam? What? Did you give any money to the guy? I had forgotten my wallet, so I just kept smiling and he went away. So being a complete airhead is built-in scammer defense. <laughs> well, whatever works. All right. Huh. And also, yeah, the guy with the parrot. I feel like I've gotten he'll, to know them well. You know, trick you in the well, guilt trick you in the paying him money to take your picture. Yeah, yeah, we already had that side quest. Oh, they have comics here. You can't get these ones in Japan. You read comics, Jungi? Yes. I started out watching superhero movies, but now I'm a true fan of the source material. I like that the heroes aren't perfect. They face adversity and make mistakes. 
and the antagonist's sense of justice clashes with the heroes like oil and water. Yeah. American comics take an approach that is rarely used in Japanese works. I think you would enjoy them as well, Kasuga-san. Dang, sounds like it's right up my alley. Even the artwork packs a punch. I might end up buying a whole series if I get really into it. Well, with the most popular series, if you include spin-offs, they can easily number over 500 volumes. So, you might want to rethink that. That many? My floors would probably implode under the weight. We're really opening up. Oh, American Damn, comics aren't so that close thick, now. and now if you also stick with the older stuff, the newer comics aren't that good. Okay, so I believe that might have been the last one for Juking Hunt for now, because I don't see any more. So I'm going to, well, I'm going to go Allo Happy. I'm going to change up a few classes. Change a few skills, do this and that. I'm loving our classes right now, but... It's time to... I want to go back to our oh, yeah, original this is cool. jobs. I also need to level up Freelancer, personally. So I can get some of these things. They're really Today's cool. fit. But we're going with Hero. Yeah. Picture perfect. Oh yeah, this is cool. What suits me? Mm. That? Get Being it? a detective. <sighs> it's like a... Oh, does it come in my size? What am I feeling? If it doesn't come in your size, we perfect. have a problem. I want to wear it all Does it allow for mobility? All right, we unlocked more for you. That's good. I got juicy taste. All right. <laughs> oh yeah, I need a makeover. All right, now we're doing skill inheritance. I'm immediately going with burning arrow here. And I'm also gonna do... That's a really good move. All right, give me a second. Rock swing is a grapple, but I can get rid of that. So I'm gonna do this. Tenacious fist, and I have not done that one yet, so I can't. Uh, why not? There we go. Badachi, let's see. You already have that one. That's good, good, good. Desperado, Bourbon Buster. Campfire Cook is essential. And then Pyro Dancer, let's do... I'm gonna give you that because if we have more of those, you're still good. And he, oh wait. Okay, you have all your moves locked. Okay. All right, Mask of Punishment, Mask of Fertility. And now we're gonna do Pepper Mill Blow, will be your grapple and medium well. All right, now let's check our gear. I'm curious, I got Super Alloy Bat. True hero's armor. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I didn't expect. I, I'm gonna immediately put that on me. Yeah, super alloy bat, 162. Special police baton. All right. Let's see. What do I want to give you? I, the dragon, is on Namba. I can give you a black belt. And let me see, is that your best one? I'm going to... Let me see, you're at 49... Let me see. Alright, yeah, no, I'm going to actually... Uh, yeah, you'll get it. Cyber armor. The wizard hat? No, I know who I'm giving that to. Okay, you... A satin choker. Ooh. Now, let me see. Is that your best body armor? Yes, it is. Boxing shoes? Mm -hmm. 
Ooh, okay, who has the highest willpower? Bum, 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 bum. Oh, wow. Uh, out of everyone, you. But he already has it. Okay. Well, I'm going to keep that with you for now. Now you... Oh, wait, what? Okay. You are all good, because you got the perfect pause, and then spacecraft wench. Whew. All right. Yeah, I didn't... Oh, wait, yeah, you do have one. Oh, that shocked me. And that is your best armor. You got mystic shoes. You need better willpower, not gonna lie. Give me a second. No, 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 no. There we go. Now you got better willpower. Okay. And now, we're gonna take a stop at Julie's Gearworks. You're probably like, why? Because things are about to happen, and I want to be ready. I'm about to upgrade Welcome. these weapons. What is it now? Alright, hero, super alloy bat. Strengthen the weapon. We have... Alright. Yeah, okay. Um, I have luscious steel. Don't know why I have so much, but yeah. Oh, right, I'm gonna only go up to ten. I'll start right now. You'll be happy with this. I am very happy with it. And I want to brand it. It has nothing on it. It has no element. What do we have? No boost crit hit. Mm, maybe uh, magic skills can critically hit. No, no one's really using magic. No. Greatly, maybe that could be useful. Oh, I mean, yeah. Um, no, 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 no. All right, that is a blunt. Meet you right there. All Finished right. up. You are now buffed. We're gonna go to Cabby. We're gonna increase that. I'll start right now. Tell me if it's too much for you. Oh, yeah. Let's brand it. Ooh. Meet your expectations? Yeah, let's That'll see. do it. And now we're going to Eris, that and Choker. We're gonna do that a couple times, because I don't want to use pure steel on everything. Or luscious steel. Alright, there we go. I'll start right now. You'll be happy with this. Beautiful. Okay. Nope, nope, I'm not done yet. Okay, for you, you're a critter. Literally a crit. She is a critter. Uh, blade attacks, electric attacks, no, 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 these are useless. I want you to... I mean, that would be amazing on Samurai. Oof. Okay, this is not a charm one. Uh, increased success rate of debuffs. Boost basic attack. MP absorption. I'm gonna give this to her. Meet there. Finished up. And then Detective has the one police baton. I mean, honestly, I'd rather strengthen this one. Make it go up 38. Yeah, it's still in reach. All right, we're gonna strengthen this. I'll start right now. Tell me if it's too much for you. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna brand it. Once again, you are blunt. But I also, magic skills can crit, no. No. Meet your, that'll do it. 
Alright, now we're going to Hitman. The perfect pause. There we go. I'll start right now. You'll be happy with this. And oddly enough, I'm just gonna give you this. Meet your there. Finished up. Material exchange, hitman. I'll start right now. Very well. Meet you. We have a deal. Alright, give me a second. Yeah, nope. Nope. Nope, okay. Man. Oof. Yeah, he is a uh, set. Okay, I have two assassins. I'll start right very well. All right, we're good with you. We're good with you. I mean, Meet your we have a deal. Linebacker, host, samurai, breaker, chef. Housekeeper, geodancer, tennis. All right, I think I am good. I'm back again. All right, guys, your weapons are, for the most part, touched up. I must have got a lot of luscious steel doing a lot of, well, grinding. Didn't think I had that much, though. Holy cow. All right. This is it. That came out well. Kasuga. Okay, Kasuga. If everything's checked off, we're bound for District 5. I'm flying blind, that part of the city. You guys take the lead? Uh huh. No problem, but none of us have exactly been where we're heading before, have yep. we? That's true. We should expect trouble, huh? Yes. That seems wise. All right, we got two links I can do. First things first, I am going to go to District 5 next time. I am also going to probably buy more items like first aid kits and stuff. Probably be for the best, if I remember. All right, I'm gonna do links, baby, except you, we're done. Which is honestly, yeah, okay. All right, Dachi, we're gonna finish yours. We got a bunch of links, get ready. Dachi-san. Kasuga, you got some time to spare? It's about Akiko-san's shop. I think you could have a word with her. That way I can warn her about the robbers. Right, yeah, sure. I mean, if I show up out of the blue, I doubt Akiko-san would hear me out. I was thinking you could go in first, be our mediator. If she doesn't listen to what I have to say, then the shop's gonna be an easy mark for those robbers. Yeah, if they actually try to break in, then we can pull one over on them and keep it from happening. Besides, when it comes to crime prevention, you're a pro. Damn straight. But if we want things to work out, I need you to get Akiko-san to come around. But not to pile on too much pressure, but we have no other option. I'll be counting on you and your sweet talk, Kasuga. <laughs> Seriously, dude? What sweet talk? Yeah, good question. What sweet talk? He tends to be blunt and oblivious. Oh, this is it? At long last, Akiko-san's jewelry shop. Must be hard to run a business like this in a foreign country. Right? That's why we gotta tighten security, make sure nothing happens. Um... Too late? Hey, Kasuga! Stay calm, and listen. Huh? What's up? Those guys who just left the shop now? They were scoping out the place before, no doubt. Same guys I saw acting shady. Seriously? Oh god, don't tell me. They already struck. What 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 now? I'm gonna check out the situation inside. Mind stalling them for me? 
There's a chance they snatched some jewelry. Wait, how am I supposed to do that? Oh, shit! No time to think. Yo! Sup, my dudes? Got a sec? Uh, so, get this. I heard a real disturbing story around these parts. Apparently, some robbers are targeting the local jewelry stores. What are you trying to say? My friend said he saw some real suspicious guys just now. Over at the shop you just left, actually. You think that's true? Did you? You know, did you see anything strange back there? Ignore him. Let's book it. Oh, wait a second. What do we have here? What's with all those bags you're carrying? Huh? You wouldn't happen to have any jewels in there, would you? Just who the hell are you? Kasuga, they're the robbers. Catch them! Yep, thought so. Roger that. What's with these guys? How's Akiko-san? They had her tied up, but don't worry. She's safe now. Great. Now it's our turn to stop him from running away. Hmm. Ready for this? The battle is on. All right, low lives. Let's do this. Let's get it done. All right, let's do it. Uh oh. Finish it. Let's do it. Yeah, that felt good. Look at me go. Oh, I got the Texas baton. Um, Adachi san, I called the police. They said they'll be here soon. All right. Good to hear. Oh, is that her? Yep, that's Akiko san. Oh, knew it. Guess that means you've got her to trust you? Well, something like that. Adachi san, Kasugo san, thank you so much for what you did. It's fine, Akiko san. No need to lower your head. I'm just glad you're safe, really. That's all that matters to me. But. I was awful to you, all because I held a grudge over something that happened decades ago. I knew the police did what they could. I knew, but I could never accept it. Not with how things turned out. I guess no matter how many signs point to a crime, there's only so much you can do. I wouldn't be so sure about that. See, Adachi-san here has his own agency now. Ads. Huh? Adachi Investigative Services, it's called. <laughs> Lame-ass name aside, he's actually an expert at crime prevention. Like, he'll advise shop owners how to improve their security to keep folks from shoplifting. He's basically a consultant who gives you tips on how to protect yourself and your business. Really, now? Hey, what's with the sales pitch, Kasuga? It's only gonna put her on the spot. Oh, no. It's fine. I was right there with him when he built his company from the ground up. I always wondered what got him so motivated. Oh, okay? Now it's finally coming together. The reason he's been working so hard. It was to face his regret. Over being unable to help you and your parents at the time. Even though you told the right people, the police, they still couldn't act when it counted. Time passed, and now here he is. In charge of an organization that can finally make a difference. Well, yeah, at least that's how I see it. Yeah, I should have figured you'd spout off a bunch of BS. Not in front of the person it's about. Come on. Hmm. Could it be there's a hint of truth in his tale? <laughs> well, I mean, 
Lots of former officers go into this kind of field. It's nothing special. Is that right? When you're a cop, you come to realize there are going to be times when you won't be able to save someone. Hmm. And to me, you were one of those people. I am so sorry I couldn't help you that time. No, don't be. Please stop. Everything's fine now. <laughs> you guys just keep on apologizing to each other. So, have you overcome 20 years of regret yet? Well, maybe I have. I don't think I've ever been happier in my whole life. To me, you're someone I can't ever thank enough. I owe you so much. Words can't describe how grateful I am. Again, thank you very much. That was nice. Isn't that great, Adachi-san? And Akiko-san doesn't resent you anymore? <laughs> it sure is. But everything that's happened only made me realize that I actually do miss running my own business. It reminded me of how I felt when I first considered starting one. Well then, in that case... What? After we're back in Eugene Show for good, how about giving it another shot? Get a dodgy investigative services back on its feet. I don't know, it's just... You know... You're doing everything you can to help me out. That's why next time, I'll be sure to return the favor. If there's anything I can do, just say the word. Well, only if it's cool with you. Unbelievable. You're willing to go that far for me? Seriously though, how about it? I mean, you were so fired up starting out. And now I know why you were so motivated, so... All right, Kasuga, enough. I get where you're coming from. I'll remember every little thing you just said, so don't go forgetting it later, all right? Hey, you ought to know me by now. I'm not that kind of half-hearted asshole, am I? True. Thanks, pal. Hmm. Yeah. Thought she's the man. Wait, 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 wait. So, real quick, what are my bonds with you? Ah, we're on your last one. Alright, let's finish up Chitose. That'd be three out of the four done. Got you on fighting Gramps. Yo, Chichan, how's it going? It's going. Uh, can we talk, Ichiban? Uh, yeah. What's up? Seriously, what's the matter? You're not looking too good. Well, it's about Gramps. I suddenly lost contact with him. Wait, your Gramps? The same old man working for the Fujinomiya family? W what happened? <sighs> He's not answering my calls, and the GPS on the smartwatch was switched off. That's never happened before. Oh, shit. You think maybe he keeled over in his room? Uh, like a seizure or something? No, unlikely. When I contacted the hotel he's staying at, I asked if one of the employees could check up on him. There is nothing off about the room. They didn't find anyone there either. Which also I hate to say, if someone keels over from that, they wouldn't turn off the watch and everything. Means... Unless the battery died. <sighs> Which means, Gramps probably tried looking for me and ran into trouble. Remember how he was worried about those rumors about me heading to District 5? Right, he got all that from Jeff, the taco truck guy. Your Gramps was buddies with him, right? Yep, you got it. Wait a sec, then Jeff might know where he'd be. Right? That's what I figured too. Come on, let's book it. You'll feel way better knowing your Gramps is safe and sound, yeah? <sighs> Sorry, Ichiban. I keep dragging you into my mess. We can talk later. Let's hurry.
And there's Jeff's truck. Your gramps had tacos for lunch every day, right? Well, not every day, but enough to become a friend and not just a regular, for sure. Yo, Jeff! Remember me? Yup, and the girl with you, too. <laughs> you guys shook up District 5 real good, huh? Who, <laughs> us? <laughs> Maybe we did, I don't know. Anyway, oh, we got something to ask you. Oh, let me guess. You're looking for another person, right? Dude, creepy. Uh, how'd you even know? A lot of folks been asking around lately. You're not the only ones looking for someone. See, he been poking around too. Huh? Ah, uh, hold up. Chichon, isn't that old man... Grant? Ah, uh, we finally meet again. So it is him! Oh, oh why is he bad. here? It was a trap. Uh, no matter how many times I requested we meet, Chitose-sama refused to visit me. That was why I had to devise a scheme of my own. The scheme? Yes, one where the elderly butler suddenly cannot be contacted and his smartwatch turned off. In that situation, what would Milady think? How would she act? As your butler, I ought to know at least that much. And sure enough, you made your way here, all for my sake. So, you're telling me you've been here waiting for me this <laughs> entire right, time? Coming. For as long as I could, whenever I couldn't be here, Jeff would try to pinpoint your whereabouts. Him of all people? But why? Who'd let an old man like him worry himself sick? Besides, the two of us are brothers for life. <laughs> Every single time he stops by, he actually compliments my tacos. So I figure I lend him a hand, help him look for this rascal wow, of a young Jeff lady. Jeff is actually a decent Sorry. person. And if you folks happen to show up here, I got some help to, you know, make sure you stick around. Oh, hold up. Why do they look ready to throw down? These guys are really fond of this old man, too. He loves tacos and pays well. Lots. He might be pushing 80, but he's damn strong. Jeff here told me something interesting. That a Japanese man with shrub-like hair was desperately chasing after Milady. Uh-oh. That would be you, I presume. What? Uh, uh, yes, but... Uh, well, well, look, the two of us are buddies now. You cretin who dare swindle the Fujinomiya heiress. I will have you apologize on your knees after due punishment. Better not take him lightly. That old man's tough as nails. I mean, my friends here are like infants compared to him. <laughs> Hell, he even sent the bear flying back in the day. Wow, you actually believe that story? <laughs> yep, no reason to doubt him. Well, that's not important right now. Uh, Gramps, sir, I'm not here to fight you. I'm sure this is all a big misunderstanding. Very big. Right, it has to be. I mean, Ichiban's my friend. P please, just calm down. With all due respect, milady, I am quite concerned about you. I know not what honeyed words he uttered to you, but you claiming him as your friend is inconceivable. This may get rather rough, but I hope that at the very least, this will open your eyes. Gramps! Do you remember the self-defense techniques I taught you? It's been some time since our last lesson, but do allow me to give you another demonstration. Gee, Johnny, he's kind of different from what I expected. I thought you said he was modest and kind. Our meeting is most unfortunate, but when I see my lady in danger, I vowed to bring hell's fury upon your head. Go get him, old man. I'm rooting for you, kinky shrubby ass. <laughs> uh oh. Don't underestimate. Let's do it. I can do this. All right. Don't get caught. Huh? I right, should start taking pace. Let's get it done. Time to go all out. 
I'll just keep doing this. <laughs> Ooh, the, the bus. The bus was MVP there. Nice. Alright, this is what I was waiting for. I kept missing. Alright, goodbye, Gramps. Oh no, he's still around. Time to go all out. Eris Choker. I think I'm getting Ooh. stronger. Think I'm getting better at. Gonna have to check that choker out after. <sighs> How could this have happened? To think I'd fall like this. <sighs> You all right, sir? Not gonna lie, you were damn strong. Krams, please don't push yourself any harder. You're not young anymore. Don't worry about me either. <laughs> well done. It seems you've retained what I taught you. In fact, your skills have greatly improved. <sighs> Seeing that puts my mind at ease. Excuse me, Gramps. Sir, uh, I'm not trying to do Cheech, uh, uh, Cheetose-san here. We've gone through a lot together. She's even been lending me a hand. I wouldn't try anything, I swear. I see. Then in that case, would you please remove yourself from a lady's side immediately? Uh, well, uh, you see... I'm sorry, Gramps, but I can't do that. You see, I... I betrayed Ichiban and his friends before, and gave them so much trouble. I have to make up for what I did, in any way I can. I'm the one who begged them to let me stay with them. Chichan... Ah, oh, Chitose-sama. What exactly have you been doing here in Hawaii? Well... A lot of things happened, but, uh, um... Long story short... I'm more or less trying to leave the nest. The nest? Meaning, the Fujinomiya family? Yeah. I can't tell them about a lot of things I've done. Or even you, Gramps. I'm sorry. <laughs> Is that right? Well then, I am very glad to hear you say so. Huh? The days we spent supporting you, milady, have finally come to fruition. Education is intended to teach the child independence. In doing so, they will be able to choose their own path. Of course, the fact that you will no longer be in my care saddens me immensely. I really am sorry for worrying you so much. And thank you for everything. I'm afraid your words are wasted on me. I humbly request for you to please tell your father that instead. He's been beside himself with worry, Chitose-sama. My family and me, we're just accessories. We only exist to make my dad look good. Nothing but props to show the crowd that a successful exec can have a happy family. You've seen it yourself, haven't you? Are you perhaps referring to the family photos? The ones taken by an intimidating number of professionals. <laughs> I do recall how you often complained that it felt like a set for some commercial. He'd always demand fixes to those photos. In fact, he's like that with pretty much everything he does. The Fujinomiya name comes first and foremost. Everything else can come second, third, whatever. He's willing to edit and fabricate anything, all so he can look better. Isn't that right? That's why the... Chi-chan? That is why the Tatara channel uploaded that video. To expose the Fujinomiya group. Oh, he knows about that. Your father recently told me that he has his suspicions regarding this Tatara's identity. It is likely an insider, one who knows the Fujinomiya group well, and one who has expressed hostility towards him and the company itself. Oh, uh, mm -hmm. I wonder who that could be. 
He said that if such a person happened to be this Tatara, then that expose might very well be his just deserts. My dad said all that? He actually blamed himself? Only when he was reflecting on how he could have possibly antagonized Tatara did he realize that. And ever since then, I could see that he has been quite sullen about it. Of course, the blow dealt to the group may have played a part in it, but I certainly doubt that was the only factor. But, Gramps, why are you telling me all this? <laughs> Indeed, why am I? Perhaps there was no reason to inform you. <laughs> However, allow me to say this. I believe you and your father still have a chance to talk things out. If the both of you continue to build up your walls, then you may lose the opportunity to conquer them. Yeah, guess so. I only wished to speak with you face to face so that I could tell you that myself. <laughs> okay, so you decided to give me another lesson in self-defense while you were at it. <laughs> My apologies. Uh, something on my face? I may not know who you are. However, the moment we clashed, I could discern that you are not one for deception. I shall refrain from prying for now. So please, look after milady in my stead. You got it, sir. You can count on me. Much obliged. <clears throat> Furthermore, there is something I must clear up with you. In my younger years, I did, in fact, lift up and throw a bear. Do not underestimate me. Can I get this guy to join my party so he can throw a bear? Well, I'll be damned. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Didn't mean to doubt you. <laughs> the two of you, take care now. Well, that was ex this uh, man. She had a really good link, dude. Are all Japanese samurai just like him? I would believe it if you told me. <laughs> Duh, I don't know. I, I've never met a samurai before. Come on, brother. Would it kill you to play along? Man, Jeff, you're weird. You're like not good, but and for yeah, you know what? Yeah, he's fine. A little shady, but he's fine. Sorry, Ichiban, for dragging you into even more trouble. <laughs> no worries. All that matters is that your Gramps is okay. But man, was he lively! I can't believe he's that strong at that age. Well, he is a Fujinomiya butler. <laughs> Makes me proud to hear you sing his praises. <laughs> You're finally starting to smile a bit more, Chi-chan. Uh, huh? Well, you weren't in a good place before, were you? Always feeling like you weren't good enough. Well, yeah. I mean, I was AG spy this whole time. Still got kicked ass. Everyone said they forgave me, but I still feel like I've got to own up to everything I've done. I'm pretty sure I told you something like this before, but you don't have to be so negative all the time. You got the best of the best in your corner. Hmm. Guess you're right, Ichiban. Yeah? You hear that, guys? Oh, look who showed up. Yeah, we got you back. Come on now, don't go keeping some crucial info from the rest of us. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> what the heck? You guys are all ready to clink glasses? Well, then you can count me in, too. Hey, who invited you to the party? <laughs> hey, don't be mean to the bartender. Ah, it's all good, man. The more the merrier, right? Oh, yeah, fine. Should have figured. Don't be mean to the bartender. Hey, He's cool. You're catching on, Tomizawa. Fast learner, aren't you? If I can let my guard down, you can too, Chitosa-san. And you've been doing great. Well, thank you very much. Anyway, you guys ready? Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Wait, whose tab is this going on? Thanks, Ichiban. <laughs> Don't mention it. All right.
Yeah, Rose was a really good link. Same with the Dachi. Dachi was nice for what he was. Tomies was just really touching. All right. Give me a second. I actually meant to check it out. Huh. Hmm. I might be able to make something good with that. Now, with you, the Eris Choker. It's not as strong, but I might also be able to do something with that. Now... Hey, buddy. We haven't done a link in a game, so... Um... Wait, real quick. Um... You are good for two. No, one. I can only do one with you? Really? Okay. Alright. Let's do a little Jungin Han, and I think I might call it. I don't think there's much more I can do Yo, before Jungi. section You're sector looking five. suave as ever, drinking here all by your lonesome. I hear that quite often. District five. But I was just thinking that it was getting a little too quiet. Oh, yeah? Oh, so you don't mind some company? That's exactly what I'm getting at. I've been thinking, and honestly, I'm real glad you're here, man. You've been a huge help, and I seriously appreciate it. I didn't even realize that the Komi Jewel Network spread as far as Hawaii. It would be more accurate to say that we asked our comrades here in Hawaii for help. Many of them scattered across the globe when the Jigon Mafia was expelled from Kamarocho. Hmm. Dang. So you basically got contacts from all over the world? Right. And there just so happened to be some in Hawaii with access to quality information on the locale. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to find out what Palikana was up to in such a short time. But let's not talk about the inner workings of the organization. Oh, oops. <laughs> Went too far there, didn't I? There's not much I'd keep secret from you now. However, you may have already noticed that I've been keeping my distance from everyone, yourself included. Yeah, I have, actually. You were just being careful, right? Because we were living life as civvies? Sounds rather pretentious, doesn't it? But you guessed right. We figured being around outcasts like us would spell trouble for you. Hmm. You know what? I missed you, but I appreciate what you did. I did miss you. I appreciate what you've done. Not just me, but Namba and Adachi-san too. Of course. <laughs> I would have felt awful if that hadn't been the case. <laughs> no doubt. This may come off a bit rude to you, Kasuga-san, but now, because of the way things turned out, I can finally talk with you. And part of me is elated about that. After all, Ijincho has been a bit of a bore as of late. The town's far too peaceful. Oh, really now? Sunny has also gotten livelier ever since Kiryu-san came to Ijincho. Yeah, she got, like... She really, really is looking up to him to the point that she thinks she has to be something that she is not. She's out on the front lines herself now. Though, that's not something that merits praise. Oh, uh, why is that? As the leader of both Komijul and the Liomang, she should not be out in the open. Whew. Not every day you hear Jungi Han himself talk about Sunhee like that. Well, the thing is, is she's a leader of two really big groups. She's putting herself out in the open, making it easy for assassins to come after her. Quite a ways away from Yi Jin Cho. It's unlikely for Sun to overhear us talking. I'm going to laugh if she calls him right now. Furthermore, with the Hawaiian skies as vast as they are, I feel a bit freer here. I will always remain loyal to Sun of course. However... I hope I could get a pass every so often. Hmm. <laughs> I want to know. <laughs> what would you do if I ratted you out to Sunhee? Uh, told her you start griping about her the moment you got to Hawaii. <laughs> oh no, I wouldn't do a thing. After all, you're free to do as you wish, Kasuga-san. However. I might just return the favor, and in doing so, cast our friendship aside. And as a result of your actions, that lost trust can never be regained, no matter what. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> hey, come on, man. Lighten up. <laughs> it was just a joke. Ha, indeed it was. I did have myself a little chuckle. <laughs> Yikes. I think I actually pissed him off just now. Maybe I ought to... Oh, yep, yep. Uh, fast text is I fast. said that I was keeping my distance from you all, but in truth, I'd been keeping an eye on you. I know that you were employed at Hello Work and that you were helping former Yakuza land new jobs. I had no clue about that. Thanks, man. When Adachi san started up his investigation firm, I wanted to lend him a helping hand as well. But in the end, I agreed with Sunny that it was best we do not intervene. Yeah, but if Adachi san had access to Komi Jewel's network, oh, that would have helped him out a ton. Well, the fact of the matter is that you could get things done without us. All of you are very capable individuals. <laughs> I guess you were watching over us for a lot longer than I thought. Oh? Sounds as if you're implying that I was some sort of stalker. Collecting information within Ijin Cho's how Gomichu puts food on the table. You were merely one part of that. All right, all right. Let's just leave it at that. But since it did make me smile, how about another drink? Ah, that'd be welcome. It's been a while since we last drank to something, Kasuka-san. Sure has. Cheers, Cheers, man. Hmm. Now I wonder what his link's gonna lead to. Ooh, du- Okay. Dual pistols? Okay, sweet. We got another one with them. Yeah, this one might hint at what it might lead to. I have no idea. It looks like Jun Han's on the phone. Wonder if he's talking to Song He. So, were you on the phone with Sun He earlier? Oh, no, I wasn't. I was actually speaking with a subordinate of mine. I let an officer candidate take care of things while I'm away from Ijin Cho. They're young, but capable. Oh, yeah? Everything good over there without you at the helm? Everything should be. Up until now, I've only been managing some rather mundane group work. I apologize if this sounds arrogant of me, but I felt that I was above such menial tasks. Considering that it's just routine, I'm sure anyone could take over from me. Huh. Then why the phone call? What was that all about? That subordinate of yours struggling because you're not there or something? Small problem seems to have cropped up, but I let them decide how they should handle it. All I said was, I'll leave it up to your discretion. You know, if you were my boss, I feel like I'd have to be ready for everything and anything. Compared to the time when Ryo Aoki attempted to take over Ijin Cho, we can now afford to give our subordinates more opportunities to grow. Those were certainly trying days. Especially when all of Ijin Cho's secrets were exposed. Right, the counterfeiting. <laughs> you can say that again. Yeah. Chairman Hoshino, the elder of the Ijin Three, was murdered, and the Omi Alliance sent in an entire army. And since we were so dependent on the gray zones of Ijin Cho, Bleach Japan nearly rendered us extinct. Just thinking about it makes me shudder. Don't you feel that way too, Kasuga-san? <laughs> Sounds like you've got an itching for some trouble. <laughs> yes, maybe so. I did come all the way to Hawaii to join you after all. I better not get too cocky. Now's not the time to let up. Things are about to get serious. Yes, of course. You can count on me. I haven't gotten that rusty during peacetime. Rest assured, I will always perform at my best, regardless of whether I'm relaxed or as nervous as ever. <laughs> You're one reliable guy. No wonder Sunny thinks so highly of you. I guess I should thank her properly sometime. I mean, she did send her right-hand man all across the ocean to help us out. Just the thought alone is enough. I'll relay your words to Sunny myself. Right now, she seems to be enjoying her time out on the front lines with Kazuma Kiryu. I have a feeling that both parties are going to merge into one in a way by the end of the game at one final confrontation. It's... Yeah. Ah, gotcha. 
Or, technically, each one can have their own final boss, because we're in Hawaii going against the one guy, the Palakana, and then they're going after the Yakuza threat. Mm, maybe, but also they are trying to move all of them to Hawaii, so we'll see. Did you get to meet Kiryu-san too? Yes, at least long enough to greet him. He seemed to be faring much better than I had heard. That's he changed good. his hairstyle since we last met, so took me by surprise. Oh, yeah, same here. I was a little confused when I saw him, too. When Sunny heard that he was returning to Japan, she was quick to make her move. Before I knew it, she stuck right by Kiryu-san's side at all times. She didn't even consult me about it. At the very least, I would have liked her to ask for permission of some sort. Honestly, I'm just glad Kiryu-san's got Sunny there to support him. With all that she's doing, shouldn't I be thanking her myself? Oh no, it's fine. No need to do all that. Don't you worry, Kasuga-san. I'll be sure to tell her. Maybe I'm overthinking it, but it feels like he doesn't want me to talk about Sunny to Song Hee. That reminds me. Are you aware that when Sunny went around town with Kiryu-san, Zhao joined them? That was when she told me to keep watch over the different factions. In that moment, I felt as if I was being left out. Huh. So now Kiryu-san's got Zhao on his side. Sounds like we're going all out now. We most certainly are. Even I've come back to the fray. Yeah. I do hope that I can be of some use. Basically, we're fighting on two fronts right now. We're trying to push both sides, but they keep... They're like three steps ahead of us every time we think we're making progress. It's a trap. It's a trap, 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 trap. To you, Kasuga-san. Right on! It'll be like the good old times! Glad to have you back, Jungi. It's a pleasure. I'll be delighted should I meet your expectations. Okay. Awesome. Well, he's ranked 2. That's better than not having a rank at all. Because now I can actually do certain attacks. So. Good. Alright, I'm going to save it and call it here. I only got 23... Not 23, geez. I only got a couple minutes left anyways uh, for the recording, and it's going to be longer anyways than what it's saying for me, because I had the uh, links to find for Jungin Han. So yeah, I'm going to call it here. Next time we'll go to District 5 and see what's going to happen there. Got a feeling big stuff's going to happen there. Do not worry, I'm going to buy items off screen. I'm going to buy some first aid kits and all that. I'm not stupid. I will record just in case when I walk out that door, in case it immediately throws me into the thick of it, but I don't think it will, but until then, I'll see you next time. And I'm happy with the group I have right now, yeah. I'll double check and make sure Chitose has some healing on her, but I'm pretty sure she does. But yeah, until then, I'll see you next time. In District 5 we go, and goodbye.